Fishnet Bible Stories proudly presents Isaac's Treaty Isaac traveled to Beersheba, and the Lord appeared to him there. He said, I am the God of Abraham. Do not be afraid, because I am with you. Because of my promise to Abraham, your descendants will be many. They will be everywhere. Isaac pitched his tent, built an altar, and dug another well there too. King Abimelech visited Isaac one day. Isaac said, Why are you here? You sent me away. Abimelech said, The Lord is with you. We treated you well and the fighting has ceased. We want a treaty that you will not harm us so we can all be at peace. Isaac's servants set out food and drink, and they enjoyed a great feast. The next morning, the men made a treaty so they could all live in peace. Then Abimelech went back home, and they all lived in peace. On that very same day, Isaac's servants dug another well. We, we have found fresh water. The servants yelled. The well was a sign of God's promise, so it was named Sheba. The well of Sheba is in the town of Beersheba. When Esau turned 40 years old, he married two wives. They were Hittite women, and they made Isaac and Rebekah sigh. They caused grief to the family all the days of their lives. Thanks for watching. This was part four of Jacob and Esau's story in our Genesis series. To keep updated, hit subscribe and check out our other Bible story videos. Have a great day. Bye.